Hey there, story lovers. Welcome to chapter one of our thrilling tale set in the charming town of Salem. Picture this. The sun is setting, casting a warm golden glow over the bustling festival. Laughter and music fill the air, mingling with the sweet scent of caramel apples and the earthy aroma of roasted corn. Children are darting between vibrant stalls, their faces painted with joy. But amidst all this revelry, there's a mysterious pull towards the library, where secrets are waiting to be uncovered. So, buckle up as we dive into this enchanting adventure. Now, this reminds me of those classic tales where the ordinary meets the extraordinary. Lila Thompson, feeling an inexplicable pull, approaches the ancient library. Its stone facade and creaking wooden doors whisper secrets only she can hear. Her heart races with a mix of excitement and trepidation. Behind her, her friends, Ethan Rivera with his deep, introspective eyes. Sophie Green, her wavy blonde hair bouncing as she sketches. And Jack, ever the skeptic with arms crossed, watch with curiosity. Each friend embodies a unique essence, adding to the kaleidoscope of the festival. Jack calls out, urging Lila to stay, but her curiosity is a spark of defiance. Ethan senses something important, and Sophie dreams of treasures and untold stories. Together, they venture inside, where shadows dance and forgotten tales await. Oh, but here's where it gets really juicy. Inside the library, the air is thick with the scent of old paper. Shadows dance on the walls, and flickering light reveals a large, ancient book on a pedestal. Its cover is adorned with strange symbols that pulse with energy. As Lila reaches for the book, a chill sweeps through the room, and the atmosphere shifts. The festival's laughter fades, replaced by an eerie silence. The pages flutter open, revealing ghostly illustrations that swirl around the children like a tempest. Lila's heart races as she feels a presence, a spirit awakening, mirroring her deepest fears. Jack's skepticism clashes with Lila's belief in the supernatural, creating tension. But Lila, entranced, whispers that it's more than just a book. It's a part of their history. The spirit reveals itself, and the children stand frozen, caught between discovery and the unknown. Yeah, you thought it was over, think again. Outside, the festival continues, a facade of joy masking deeper fears within Salem's history. The children share a glance a silent vow to uncover the book's secrets. This sets the stage for an adventure that will intertwine their fates with the shadows of Salem. So what mysteries will they uncover? Stay tuned, and don't forget to subscribe to Storyteller for more of this captivating journey.